started muraling about six years ago after being um, a high school art teacher for a number of years after college. A lot of my artwork is figurative. I'm sort of I'm interested in humans and depicting them. Um, but I also use a lot of um, really bright, vibrant color and pattern. I'm really interested in pattern across all of my work. Um, and I also use um, flowers or plants and organic elements in my work a lot. I'm very interested in um, floriography, which is um, sort of telling a story through flowers. Um, it was something that became really popular in the Victorian era, and they sort of uh, started associating all these different flowers with different symbolic meanings. And, you know, people would leave flowers for people. Um, and, it, you know, it, it was this whole, like, expression that they couldn't express freely just, like, by talking to each other. Um, and so I'm really interested in that, that idea of, like, creating a s symbolic story by using flowers um, and not having to sort of, like, spell out every, uh, um, you know, every thing that I'm trying to express. And can you describe the artwork that's going to be featured at, at this festival on Saturday? Um, sure. It's... Um, it's basically uh, two portraits, um, one, two women, and one is sort of, you'll see a profile viewer, and one is uh, looking directly out at the viewer. And those two portraits sort of overlap to create this sort of uh, illusion of depth. Um, and then the woman that you see in profile is actually holding up some flowers. Um, and it, she's gonna be holding a rose, which is sort of this classic symbol of love. Um, she's holding some gladiolus, which is um, named after the gladiators of ancient Rome, and it's a symbol of strength and perseverance. Um, and she's also holding some hyssop, which is sort of the symbol of um, sacrifice and also sort of perseverance through like hard times. I wanted to do something that sort of symbolizes um, honoring the, the, the people in your life that you love while they're here, sort of give them their flowers while they can smell them. From up county to down county, to stay in the know, like, share, and subscribe to our channel.